How you doing, everybody? I want to welcome you back to the Mindset Unleashed podcast. I'm Tommy Gucciato, and I'm your host. And, uh, you know, this podcast focuses on the power of the mind and how it affects people's lives on a daily basis. You know, I'm really excited today. We have a, a, a guest that is not only uh, up and coming in the music industry, he's an entrepreneur and he has his own clothing brand. And this guy is amazing. And why don't you let, tell us a little bit about yourself? Yeah, I go by the name of JL Draft Pick, Long Island's in the building, 51631, officially here. <laughs> um, yeah, now we are. You gave me a nice introduction. I think you, know, you said it all. You said it all? <laughs> said all right. All. I'm the man, basically. <laughs> okay. Well, tell us how it started. How how did music become part of your life? Um, just like any, you know, any young kid, you know, you fall in love with music, you know, whether it was, you know, Nas, Biggie, somebody, you know, stories, you know, people going through things, and um, music just became um soundtrack to my life, you know, school, you know, you liked going through things with the music, and um, you know, as I got older, um, music kind of like fell into my lap, like I, I played around with it to the point where, you know, somebody that I knew, you know, got signed, um, got a deal, and, you know, we kind of like rode that wave as they would say and um really didn't get passionate with it until i saw somebody make money out of it, it was like you know what you can make a lot of money out of this so you know me being a you know hustler type person i am i always looked at it as a business more than anything and then through that the clothing line came um you know my business and everything else so so out and so forth so when when did you first actually start singing? Were you was it when you were a kid? When you were like well, Michael Jackson was like somebody I looked up to. I right. was there's probably videos somewhere in my mother's house. You're jumping around, yeah, singing with the dancing. hat on. Like <laughs> um, one of one of you know one of my biggest singles. All I know has a picture you know from the house where I have the Michael Jackson like hat on. I got my you know hand on my crotch doing a little right. Michael Jackson dance. So definitely Michael Jackson. I always like music, but again until I really saw somebody else you know, do it on their own and make it. I said, you know what, this is something that's actually be possible. Right. That's great, man. Yeah, man. You know, when you take your passion and kind of like flow with it and run with it, you know, it opens up a lot of doors for you. So many that to this day, it still surprises me, you know, the things I'm able to do just primarily off the music, you know, going from this avenue to another avenue. Right. Now you said, you know, it's like what you were going through, like does your music like reflect your life? Is it, do you take what happens in your daily life and put it into your music? No, nah, for sure. Um, every music, um, every song, right? that has a little bit of um you know my truth maybe it's somebody else's maybe my friends right. or somebody else's but for sure right so it's stuff that you go through what 100%, you feel it. 100%. all right cool